Hello editors, uh, we are here together to speak about your new album uh, in this light and on this evening. Uh, could you please uh, quickly introduce yourself? Yeah, I'm Chris, I play guitars and keyboards. And I'm Ed and I play drums. So why this name? Why editors? Well, I don't know. We still haven't come up with a, a good enough answer for that, have we? <laughs> uh, we, had, we had loads of bad names and then um, we uh, got a record deal and we decided that we didn't want one of those bad names to be on a record sleeve, so uh, one of us came up with a name. I can't even remember who it was. No, I think it's safe to say it's got nothing to do with the meaning. It's okay. just, uh, no. just the way it looks on the page, really. Mm. That's, uh, the way it looks in the print is very important, though. Mm. So now you like it and... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. it doesn't really mean really, anything. It looks really good on the lights outside the Olympia today. So <laughs> yeah. that, I'll take that. It's so difficult to find the name of the band nowadays. Mm. You know, something that hasn't been taken, something that isn't really... Uh, <laughs> something that isn't really kind of pretentious or anything like that. So we just wanted something that where people wouldn't get any preconceptions about the band from seeing our name. music do you play actually uh, I mean is it uh, indie rock, cold wave, electro, post punk, or perhaps all of that? Uh, I don't it's know. It's all of that. It's every, every genre. Every element yeah. apart from UK Garage. Yeah. There's it's a bit cool. of UK Garage. I don't really, I don't really, not really into genres per se. Um, yeah. uh, I guess what we play is rock, rock music in mm. its uh, basic form but we add different elements of different instruments which make it sound different. Your last album is a little bit more electro than uh, the other one. Well, Why is that? It's certainly more synthetic than synthetic? the last records. Yeah, it's not. I wouldn't call it electro. It's not necessarily dance music. It's um, I don't know. It's something we've we've discovered a lot of different sounds and different ways to use mm. the instruments that we used to use uh, just to make regular rock music. And, um, yeah, and there's a lot of vocal on the record as well. A lot of processed vocal, which. Um, creates a really unique atmosphere. When we first started making music together, we were um, we were very heavily influenced by other bands, and, you know, bands like the Bunny Men and uh, uh, yeah, Talking Heads and you know, New Order and so a lot of lots of bands like that, and lots of newer bands as well, like Strokes and Joy and um, like Joy Division. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops, and Inter Interpol and uh, you know and the AAS and all that. Uh, now I guess I'm not really influ influenced by music at all. Um, okay, mainly sort of. Uh, trying to on this last record, especially, we were trying to fit um, fit music to picture and things that were in our heads. So mm. lots of films and um, just pictures that we had in our heads. You you wanna make a sound uh, yes. that looks different? Yeah. The, the others. Uh, oh, definitely. Mm. Yeah. yeah, definitely. I think that's that's what every band should try and aim mm. for when they start a record. You know, what hasn't what haven't we done? What what sort of different influences can we use to, mm. to paint a brand new picture? Really. Um, and that's what we've tried to do, definitely. And we'll try and do that again on the re next record. But we're not going to just stick with one sound or one look or one mm. image. We've got to, got to move on. I don't want to be ignored. Oh, God. When I'm a gun in a fist fight. You're chewing with an open mouth. Raw meat. Your blood drool attracts the fly. Basic question, where do you come from? Nottingham. Ipswich. And uh, how do you met? We met at university. A day, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, we didn't. We met at university. At university? All, uh, all, of all together. Same okay. course, we lived together. Same house. Okay. Same band. <laughs> um, so that's a question a little bit special. Do you prefer uh, a small scene with uh, intimacy with uh, the people in there? Oh, more big show with many people. Big uh, shows, yeah. definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Why? Big shows. I, I feel like you've got just more. It, it's, there's more going on. There's more stuff to look at. There's kind of the atmosphere is really just lifts, lifts. lifts. There's no stopping it sometimes. And I, mm. I love that. 
A few thousand people sound better than a few hundred people. Yes, okay. Yeah, and backstage is better. <laughs> <laughs> What's make it different from uh, The Elders One? This record is quite substantially different from record two, which was quite bombastic, very you know, euphoric, I guess, in places, really big sounding rock record. And this has got, I don't know, this one's got more space in it. Um, let every part have its own place and not layer it up and confuse it with other, other sounds. So it's, um, it's kind of more succinct than the last record. Wait for the from music, in what else are you interested in? Um, buildings. Yeah. Football. Um, food. Wrestling. Mm. Running. Television. Tennis. Mega. eBay. I like eBay. Uh, Video so games. Uh, what do you have in your iPod? Actually, um, no. Not much. I can show you if you, if you want. There's <laughs> only like a little bit of the stuff that I have. Um, have you got yours with you? No. I have Box Rebellion, Cabaret Voltaire, Cold Cave, George Carlin, The Horrors, The Maccabees, Renegade Soundwave, Six Finger Satellite, Vitalik, and the Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all I've got on my. Okay. I've got more on my iPhone, but that's what I'm listening to at the moment. It's pretty good. Succinct as well. It's all right, isn't it? <laughs> so Six Finger Satellite are a new band that I've just discovered. They're well, not new, they're from the 90s, but they're, it was um, the, the Juan McLean, the DFA hmm. guy. It's his old band. They're really good. When inspired you really when you listen to music you listen to the same album all the time so that uh, you keep that in mind and uh, mm. it's a really question listen. of period maybe yeah, maybe I don't really listen to that much music anymore not mm. as much as I used to yeah. I don't really have the time to do it anymore and we, we put on quite a lot in the dressing room we vary that quite a lot so okay that's, that's our that's our music for the day you know you don't want to hear the thing is if you're in a band you're surrounded by music all the time you want to get away from it sometimes and just walk you around with nothing going on in your ear. That's kind of nice. So uh, thank you for, for your time Thanks and uh, have a good day. Thank so you. bye bye. It's cool, man. Are you more Pepsi or Coca Cola? Coca Cola. Neither really, but Pepsi has a better logo. <laughs> okay. Uh, more Paris or New York? New York. New York. Why? Because it's better. <laughs> okay. In every way. <laughs> Sorry. Most Khaled Johansson or uh, Marion Cotillard? Uh, I'll be honest, I don't know the second one. <laughs> uh, that's uh, a French actress <laughs> in uh, La Bombe. I bet she's really hot. And Who hot was the yet. first one? Uh, uh, Scarlett Scarlett Johansson. Johansson. Oh, or the French girl. <laughs> okay. I'd the probably French choose girl. the French girl. Yeah, yeah. French girls. <laughs> <laughs> uh, are you more summer or winter? Winter. Summer. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's are you very more? Different, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ying and Yang, ice uh, and dice. <laughs> are you more a Simpson or Dora's Explorer? <laughs> Again, don't know. The no, story. Simpson. Simpson. <laughs> more McDo or Subway? What's the first one? McDo. McDonald's. Oh, right. oh God. Uh, Again, neither, neither. But Subway is probably easier. Yeah. Are you more Lady Gaga or Black Eyed Peas? Lady Gaga. <laughs> Lady Gaga. <laughs> Okay, all right. Yeah. So, uh, That's a really bad choice. But, yeah. Difficult choice. <laughs> no, easy choice. Easy choice, but yeah. bad choice nonetheless. Yeah. That was our goal in this <laughs> discussion. Yeah.